Genius Loci To have been born in a land of scorching summers, where trees catch fire by spontaneous combustion, and earth expends its life juices in the fulfilment of a drought. To have been born in a land of earthquakes, childhood bred amid the fear and wonder of that raging bull who drives his horns in claustrophobic anger through the underbelly of the earth, ramming it, assailing it, shivering in his wrath. To have been born among high mountains, to sense in one's blood the rise and fall, the lofty heights and awesome depths, the fury of the flaming ice, to aspire to climbing, and climbing, to scale beyond the vertigo of falling. To have been born beside the sea, to hear one's own life ebbing, flowing in the current, as quick as love or blood. To have been born in a land of avalanche or monsoon, of volcano or scorching desert, to witness the energies of life and death pressed to their limits, tearing one's soul into full awakenness, granting one the most intimate knowledge of the divine, the most immediate experience of the unknown. But alas, I was born in a city of stone, on a cold, flat marsh, beneath a dull, high moor, with scenery lush but undramatic. Upon such still and quiet earth, the climate moderate, the landscape of my life eked out of pastoral field and elegiac elm. What choice then did I have but to seek God and to create God? in my imagination.